Hello everybody and welcome to a new video. In this video, I'll show you what a typical day at school in the Netherlands looks like for me. Today I woke up a bit later than usual, just because I could. I quickly gathered all my things, had a drink, and then my friend was already at the door, ready to drive to school. Recently, the weather in the Netherlands has been mixed. There is a lot of cloudiness and sun, but it is still cold outside. It's not raining, so that's nice, but still. And that's why I'm turning the seat heating on full blast. If we don't have a car, we take the train. You can see the train tracks on the right side of the screen. By car, it takes us about 80 minutes to get to school. And if we take the train, it takes us about 45 minutes. Luckily, we usually have a car at our disposal and can drive to school comfortably. A school year in the Netherlands consists of two semesters. And each semester has two blocks. In total there are four blocks and in each block you get new subjects. Right now we are almost at the end of the block. That means exams are getting closer. At this stage of the block we need to make sure we finish our reports and make our presentations for our research projects. In this block we don't have a lot of exams but we have a lot of reports that we need to turn in. If I am specific we have a report to make for innovation management, for process design and for the subject Information Technology Innovation. Personally, I liked making the report for the subject Process Design the most, because it's the report about the research we do at our internship companies. My first lesson of today is Information Technology Innovation, also called ITI. In this lesson, we presented our reports and we got some feedback from our teacher. For ITI, my group and I made a report about semi-automatic welding. The feedback from our teacher was positive, so that's good. After the lesson ITI, we went to the cafeteria. But this time, I'm not buying lunch, but I brought my own. This is the first time in four years that I brought my own lunch to school. Yeah, I know, that's bad. After lunch, we had one hour of free time. So we spent this time working on material design and engineering. For the study program Industrial Engineering and Management at my school, we don't get any programming. That's a bummer, because we really can use some programming skills to analyze big sets of data. A friend of mine is teaching himself some Python, so he's now showing the work that he already did. It's maybe not the most advanced code, but it works. After our one hour of free time, we had our last lecture for today, which was Material Design and Engineering. The exam for this course will be an oral assessment via an online meeting. I don't like that that much because I like to think about my answers and then write them down. The questions for the exam will all be about pump design. After the lecture Material Design and Engineering, it was time to pack our stuff and go home. Sometimes we have short days of lessons. I don't mind this, because then I have enough time to work on my side projects. Oh, yeah. On our way home, a stone hit our windshield. So that needs to be repaired. Once I arrive home, I will go and walk with the dog. In this muddy area, there will be a new neighborhood soon. There isn't a lot of progress yet, but 
I'm quite curious how it will go. Once I was done walking with the dog, it was time to do some work. And after that, it was time to relax. So I watched some Netflix and I went to bed. Thank you.